Hi there, everyone. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you're all doing well. It's been a while. <laughs> no, Morris. You're out this time. So, we were doing the reverse proposal mod, and my gosh, I am sorry, but this took forever. Oh, it took days upon days upon days upon days in this game just to get the friendship things up oh my gosh and then they like certain gifts and you don't have the ability to get that gift yet ah uh, so I'm sorry this took so long to complete I cheated I cheated with this I went online and I looked up a picture where all the eggs were <laughs> And then I missed some anyway. But I got it. More than I normally do. Ah. So we started in obviously spring. Then you gotta go through summer. Yeah, this is how I felt. It was so hard to get those friendship points up. Every day. It was like a routine. Take care of your farm. Feed the cat. Look at the animals. Get all your machines in order, and then run around town looking for somebody to talk to. Didn't this used to be something else other than wheat? I still don't get this. Well, I did get the old one, and I thought it was disgusting, but wheat? Did they change that? <laughs> and it still doesn't make sense. Haley, you're disgusting. Finally, you can tell it's midwinter here. And finally, I wasn't even prepared for this, so I apologize. I'm like, why is Elliot standing in my... Does he come over to the farm? I don't think he comes to the... Oh my gosh, this must be it. So I quickly hit record. Oh, there's nothing wrong. It's just that... It got me thinking about the past weeks that we are together. This must be foreign. It's not quite written properly. I suddenly realize how I'm happy that I have someone I can share. Hello? You've become someone very special to me. Will you be my girlfriend? <laughs> that is so cute. I'm sorry. <laughs> that is just so cute. I have to say, up front, no, I was not expecting it to be Elliot. And I did promise in the last video that I would be as neutral as I could, as fair as I could, as far as gift giving and talking to them went. Sam vanished on me. And Harvey wasn't as difficult to find. But I, again, I rarely saw Elliot. I, there were times when I did but there were times when you assumed you would. He's usually on the pier, and sometimes he just wasn't there. Or else he's in the museum. So, how this happened, I'm not quite sure, but I just think this is adorable. <laughs> I thought that I had spent a lot, my most amount of time with Sebastian, because I was usually at the carpentry shop, befriending Robin and Demetrius to get recipes. I don't know why I did that, but I had nothing to do all this time. Oh man, it took me all this time just to get this far in the game. I don't know how, well, I guess I do. Fred loves me, by the way, and yes, he did give me gifts. I just never remember to record them. It's, it's really cute. I'd say every other day, You'd come out of your house and there'd be something sitting on the porch and then the bottom left side there would be a little pop-up saying Fred left you a gift. <laughs> so I have everything. I made it to level, what is it, 25 in the Calico Desert mine. I got 10 grand from Chi and I have my pigs. I have deluxe barns and deluxe coops and the community center's done. So that boosted, I think that was what did it. 
was boosting the friendship. The gypsy lady had the red cabbage that I needed. That was the last thing I needed, and she had it, so I bought that. Uh, I went to town on the crops this time. Crops, mayonnaise, and cheese. And man, I ended up with over a million gold at one point. I was stunned. So I decked out my house, and I made a lot more of those canning machines. I have some wine casks and all that tea. The gypsy lady was selling it. I'm like, I'll take it. I didn't even talk to Caroline. So, but grandma had given me the pot. Yeah, I lucked out with the gypsy lady. So that was cool. Oh man, though. I was trying to say that I'm sure the younger you are, the longer you can sit in front of a screen and do repetitive things again and again and again. Because that's all this game really is. You wake up, you take care of things, you go to sleep, you wake up, you take care of things, you go to sleep. And I'm not saying that it isn't fun, because I love this game. I play it all the time. It's just more difficult when you're trying to entertain other people with it and you're trying to come up with interesting things to show and I just I'm not seeing it I'm not seeing where anything would be so interesting that you'd want to watch it because it is very repetitive it's not like you haven't seen this before yeah I was disappointed here now I did say I had another mod that took care of the community center after it was finished Penny and the kids go into that kitchen area. It becomes a little school. It didn't. And the fish tank is supposed to be filled. And neither of those occurred, so there must be something wrong with that mod. I'm not sure. But that didn't work. I was a little disappointed. Or did I not install it? Maybe I didn't... Maybe I said I would, and I didn't. So I was wondering why it didn't work, but hey, you never know. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, yeah, and I got this boat upgraded. Because as I mentioned, I've already been to the Calico Desert and the mine. I've gone down more than 25 flights, and there's a ton of iridium down there. And I upgraded my tools to gold so I could go into that secret forest and get the hardwood. Man, I had a ton of hardwood. But you get hardwood in the regular mine. Sometimes it just shows up. I have to tell you though, this new aspect of the game, it just does not interest me. It doesn't appeal to me at all. This new island and cheese quests and I don't know. I just... I have never done this. Well, I, I've done this. I've gone this far, and I've gotten off the boat, and I've walked around as far as I can, but... I just go back. It's like, I really don't feel like doing this. Maybe I should. I don't know. Maybe this would... Well, I don't want to say bring excitement to the game. I'm telling you. The game is exciting. It's enjoyable. I love playing this game. I just don't know what you guys would want to see me doing. You know what I mean? The day-to-day -day stuff, it just sounds kind of weird for me to be doing it. I know that probably sounds weird too, but I, I don't know. Maybe I should give this a shot. I'm just... It doesn't appeal to me. Kind of like in Animal Crossing, I got the DLC and I went there and I did the houses and I quickly lost interest. I just wasn't interested in doing the DLC. Then I kind of feel that way about this boat. Sorry, Willie. I like you, but I don't know about that other island. Why am I not interested? Everybody else was so excited about it and I'm like, okay. I'll give it a shot, and then I never did. My museum is totally mucked up here. I did get a prismatic shard, 
but I used it to get the sword so there isn't one in here but I didn't it's always different I guess maybe that's supposed to be normal you don't always collect the same things for the museum I have no idea yeah I forgot that I had upgraded my garbage can for like a week I'm like oh am I not supposed to get something this is the garbage can but anyway that was the reverse proposal mod and I like it I think it's great I wish there was a way to do that in The Sims 4, let me tell you. But thank you for being patient and watching this all the way through. I really appreciate that. Sorry it took so long. But I do hope you enjoyed it. Like the video if you did. Subscribe if you're interested. Take very good care of yourselves as well. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.